Yes, hello. Hello. This is Arsene Wakov. Ah, uh, yes. Hello, sir. How are you? Uh, my name is Marcus Michelli. I uh, work for Dr. Charles Kopchin here. I'm the director for Central and Eastern European Affairs at the National Security Council. Uh, Mr. Kupchin is not here right now, so uh, I've been asked to take the call. Yeah, he was, what I remember is he was discussing it uh, here, and uh, we'll, you, as, as you probably know, we've provided a uh, large amount of security-related assistance already mm -hmm. uh, to your armed forces, to your state border guards, and to, it will be, to the National Guard. Uh, and when President Poroshenko was here yeah, yeah. just a week ago, we announced a, an additional, a total of $46 million in mm -hmm. additional assistance. So you were talking about assistance, mostly uh, security-related assistance that would go to the armed forces and to the border guards, correct? Exactly, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, so we have, um, you know, I'd be very happy to pass... Uh, a list, for instance, we could do it through our through Ambassador Pyatt uh, in Kiev, yes. and at, or or we could do it here through um, Ambassador Motsik uh, here to ask them to send to you. Maybe through Ambassador Pyatt would be better. And yeah, yeah, sure. With the full list, yeah, the full list of the equipment that we've provided or are providing. Some of it hasn't arrived yet, you know, because obviously some of the assistance that the pres our president announced during the visit of President Poroshenko, that has not uh, reached uh, Ukraine yet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. I was talking to uh, embassy in Kiev. Yes. Uh, I also want to ask about, uh, may maybe you can organize a conversation uh, between me and uh, uh, Victoria Nuland? Uh, that you would need to ask, uh, you would need to ask Ambassador Pyatt. Yeah, okay. Uh, because that's through, that's Department of State. All right. Yeah, through, through State Department. You know, in other words, it's the difference between, um, you know, your Ministry of Foreign Affairs, mm -hmm. uh, Minister Klimkin, and people, you know, in his his office, and then uh, us basically working for presidential administration. You yeah, know, yeah, yeah. The, you know, Mr. Loshkin and, and people in that. Uh, yeah, yeah. Of, you know, or Charlie, I guess. Yes, no, absolutely. I know uh, uh, Dr. Kupchin had uh, discussed it and passed it around. Yeah, definitely. I mean, what, we're, what we've looked for is what are we, uh, what are we providing? And pull, what we're doing is pulling together a good list uh, that we could share, we could send to Ambassador Pyatt, so you can see what we've been providing. All right. All right. But Mr. Kupchin is not there? No, he's not here right now. Okay. Yeah, but I, I mean, I work for him, and I do oh. work on Ukrainian issues, so I'm All familiar right. with uh, your request, I'm familiar with your email, he mentioned it to me, uh, so uh, I will pass along that you called. Okay. And what we'll try to do is get something to Ambassador Pyatt, uh, so when you meet with him on Wednesday, uh, oh, yeah. you'll be able to talk with more detail. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. so thank you. Yeah, thank you very much for calling. I wish yeah. you a uh, uh, good good evening, and uh, yeah. I guess it's quite late there, and uh, and a very good weekend. Yeah, and you too. We should uh, keep keep the conversation. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Uh, absolutely. Thank you okay. for everything. Yeah. Right, thank you. Bye. Thanks. Right. Bye.